Hey guys and welcome to this episode of Quite Frankly. Now you know we give a lot of tips about photography and other stuff, right? Now in this case I want to give you a tip that has no, not directly something to do with photography but can actually be incredibly handy when you're traveling. Now we all have the problem that when we travel we sometimes have stuff on our laptop that we don't want other people to see. Now it's not like if you're teaching a student will go through your laptop uh, to find some images or documents or whatever but Sometimes it's just, well, it doesn't feel right to have documents about new software on your hard drive, right? Or images you shot with new strokes. So there is a way, of course, to protect a folder with a password. But often you have to use apps from the App Store or software from other parties. And they cost money, right? And I'm Dutch. So a free solution is actually built into macOS. But a lot of people don't know about it. And it's really easy to do. What you do is you go into your disk utility and you go into file. Now you go to new and what you actually do is disk image from folder. Now let's say I don't want people to see my internet ready images. What I will do is I will create an image of those. I will press image. And how do you want to call the image? Of course, secret, which by the way is not very smart to do, but okay. You can choose read-only, compressed, read-write, DVD, hybrid image, or whatever, but just use compressed, for example. You go to your encryption, and let's say 108, 128 bits, and you press save. It now creates the, the DMG. Now you need a password. Let's see an easy password, Dorhof. That's also not very smart, of course, but okay. Make sure that you don't use this, so this has to be off. Because otherwise, well, it doesn't make any sense to create a password that's in your keychain, right? And you press OK. Now, if somebody sees the secret DMG, they, of course, want to open it because everything that's secret is interesting. And they will click on it. And it will actually ask for a password. So, well, it doesn't open, right? Unless, of course, you know the password. So there you go. As you can see, as soon as I use the password, it opens up just like a normal disk folder. And I can just see all my images. Now, when I'm done with it, I very simply right-click and say Eject. And I still have the secret DMG there. So that's my tip for today. Make sure that your data is safe and your documents that are sensitive can't be read by anybody else. And it's a free macOS tip. <laughs>